Okay, hold on. Where does it hurt? Ah, my stomach. I have a bad case of diarrhea. I have a bad case of diarrhea. I have a bad case of Gloria Borger! News. Welcome to Owo News, the number one news source on the internet. Can't be beat by anyone. Not even CNN. Or should I say, Communist News Network. <laughs> I'm your host, Gloria Borger. And today we have some news to look at, some lovely news. Let's just jump right into it. Our first news today is <laughs> Xena Bash moved her hand and the resistance saw a chocolate cake symbol. Then she did it again. I'm using a code word for chocolate cake because otherwise I'll become Casey Neistat. So <laughs> this is the most ridiculous title I've ever seen in my entire life. What is this chocolate cake symbol that Xena Bash moved her hand into the position of and then did it again? It's this right here. It's this, it's this. <laughs> How is this? A chocolate cake symbol, you might ask. Well, do I have a story for you? This is it right here. The three right here, three fingers represent a W for the chocolate part. And then this right here is a P for the cake. Chocolate cake. This started off as a joke on 4chan. People on 4chan knew how ridiculous the world is. They knew that they take st stuff like PP the frog, which I'm pronouncing not correctly because I don't want to be Casey Neistat. And they told everyone on 4chan to go spread this misinformation that this was a chocolate cake symbol when it's really, it's really not because they wanted to see how far it would get. And here we are. People are actually taking it seriously and freaking out. Everyone freaked out on Twitter and the news is writing about it. And this is just one of two cases we'll be looking at today. <laughs> this joke on 4chan caused this to be taken as somebody saying, oh yeah, chocolate cake. Ridiculous. <laughs> Republican, oh, Republican. Urgh. No wonder she likes chocolate cake so much. Urgh. Nasty Republic Republican operative Xena Bash rested her hand on her arm. This is from the Washington Post, by the way. Fingers closed into a circle as she sat behind Brett Kavanaugh during his confirmation hearing on Tuesday. And hashtag resistance Twitter, watching the hearings live and seeing her hand, saw a secret nefarious code. Bash was making the okay sign with her hand, it appeared. Eugene Goo. A doctor with more than 200,000 Twitter followers who has become a well-known hashtag resistance Twitter figure tweeted that Bash was flashing a chocolate cake sign behind him during his Senate confirmation hearing. They literally want to bring chocolate cake to the Supreme Court. What a national outrage and a disgrace to the rule of law. Now I'm Gloria Borger and I'm not supposed to give my own opinion, but I mean... <laughs> I think this is the most ridiculous thing I've ever seen on the internet to this date. I thought PP the frog, I thought that was ridiculous. This is like an entirely other next level of ridiculous. This is the okay sign. This is the okay sign. We have used as humans for hundreds of years to say okay, and now all of a sudden, because supposedly some chocolate cake supremacists are using this as a hate symbol, which it was really a joke from 4chan. If you did any research at all, you would know it was a joke. Apparently now we can no longer use the okay symbol just because Allegedly, bad people were using it. Even if it was true, chocolate cake supremacists were using the symbol, don't you think it'd be kind of dumb to let them ruin a widely used symbol? That's like saying you can't say the word okay because a racist once said the word okay. You know what I'm saying? It makes no sense. <laughs> it just shows how ridiculous the internet is. It shows how ridiculous the internet is. And one more thing I'd like to point out, Washington Post. Hmm, if we look up here, their little icon is WP. Chocolate cake? Ooh. That's the level of ridiculous we're talking about. It's like literally making associations when there is none to be made. <laughs> That's not the only instance of this symbol in the news recently. Coast Guard member reassigned after he flashed offensive hand gesture 
on TV. Oh my god. The Coast Guard has reassigned a member after he flashed a controversial hand sign some have associated with chocolate cake during a television appearance. The video shows a man briefly making an OK sign in the background of an MSNBC appearance featuring Captain John Reed giving an update on the Coast Guard's Florence Storm response efforts, according to NBC News. The symbol has been called a trolling gesture by the Anti-Defamation League. The OK Signs association with the chocolate cake movement started out as a 2017 hoax campaign aimed at drumming up false outrage. But it didn't start out as that. It has always been that. <laughs> it's... No one has ever used this to legitimately mean chocolate cake. No one ever has used this to mean that. It's always been a troll, and it worked so well to create false outrage, as we can see right here. <laughs> they literally reassigned someone in the Coast Guard because they made the OK sign. That's the level of ridiculous. Oh my god. The Coast Guard described the video featuring the symbol as offensive in a tweet announcing that the member shown in the video has been reassigned. Imagine if you are like struggling to live in Hurricane Florence, right? You decided not to evacuate because you're a dumbass. The floodwaters are just rushing in. You're gonna die. But then the Coast Guard comes up on a boat because your streets are flooded. They just take their little boat, come up right next to you and they're like, hey, we're here to rescue you. And you're like, oh, and then they're like, sorry, that was an offensive symbol. Um, we're not gonna rescue you anymore. Like, how ridiculous is this world? I mean, oh my God, how ridiculous. <laughs> Let's watch this uh, symbol being made. We're looking at this guy right here. Watch what he does with his hands. <laughs> Did you catch that? Oh my God, <laughs> that was so offensive. Oh my God, look. <laughs> that was it! That was it, and that caused him to be reassigned. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> His actions do not reflect those of the United States Coast Guard, the tweet says. Oh my god. Some on social media have called for the Coast Guardsman to be fired for his actions. His actions of doing, of doing this, but not even doing this, just resting his hand. And that, like, look. I'm doing it right now. I'm doing it right now. This is a very comfortable position on my head. The circle goes right freaking under your chin when you sit down. That's what he was doing. He was just doing that. Could you imagine being fired for making the okay sign? Like not even making the okay sign, just doing it because that's just what your hand does. Could you imagine being fired for that? This is the world we live in. 2018, I'm Gloria Borger. The okay gesture is commonly used for non-political and non-hateful purposes as well as some chocolate cakeists, according to the ADL. Oh my God. <laughs> is this a real life? Like, this is 1984, but we're living it right now in 2018. Let's look at some, some Twitter responses to, to this horrible travesty that's befallen mankind. Someone making the okay symbol. People are dying and in danger, and this US Coast Guard member feels it's the right time to assert his chocolate cake. Disgusting and disgraceful. This was no accident. I hope that the US Coast Guard will do the right thing and investigate this national disgrace. This national disgrace. Oh my God. If you think it's a meaningless gesture that doesn't signify anything, ask yourself why they keep throwing it. He's resting his hand. That's like his hand just made that shape. He wasn't trying to even make that shape at all with his hand. It just happened. Your hands, move to support your head throughout the day when you rest on them. And that just happened to be, like imagine if someone dug up video of you, Adam Weinstein. First of all, if we're gonna make conclusions, right? We're gonna make conclusions from point A to point D without any correlation whatsoever. Like, oh, this person makes the freaking okay sign and that's apparently racist now. Your last name is Weinstein. Harvey Weinstein, <laughs> got him, you should be fired. That's, that's as ridiculous as what you're saying, seriously. They keep throwing it because they're not throwing it. You're just drawing conclusions and you're reading way too far into something that you shouldn't even read into at all because it's so insignificant. It's not meant to be anything. That's just how his hand was. Even if it was this, right? That means okay. It doesn't mean chocolate cake. That was an internet troll joke. It was a, it was a troll on 4chan to cause your reaction. They knew they would get your reaction out of it and it worked and it's hilarious. It's also really scary because it shows how just ridiculous 
People are. If the OK hand sign is an offensive chocolate cake signal, should Apple and Google remove it from their smartphone keyboards? I mean, seriously, everyone, this emoji is available to everyone. It's the OK sign. What the hell? What world are we living in? <laughs> also, here's a black person doing the OK sign. Very clearly, it does not mean chocolate cake. <laughs> That's all I have to say on that one. And that is gonna do it for this OO news. So let me know what you thought. Comment down below, leave a like, smash like, follow my Patreon. For just a dollar a month, you can support the channel. That's $12 a year. I couldn't do it without my lovely patrons listed on your screen right now. All my patrons, even at the $1 tier, get access to all my videos early every single video early. Sometimes you get it five minutes early before it goes live, or sometimes you get it a couple days before it goes live. It just depends on when I finish the video, but nonetheless, you get access to my videos early. So I think that's worth it to become at least a $1 patron so you can see all my videos early. Plus you get access to an exclusive Discord chat. I hop on every once in a while in either text or voice chat with all my lovely patrons. And it's just a fun time, it's a fun time. So please check out the Patreon, link down below. Don't forget to follow my second channel. Oh, whoa, what's this? Go subscribe if you haven't done so already. Some lovely vlogs from my IRL life. Go check it out, here's a lovely clip. I just went inside, loves, and I defecated. The restrooms are very nice. Inside loves, that's why I like it so much. All the stalls are very high quality, nice. They're clean, they're always clean. Nice place to utilize the restroom, for a gas station especially. Now it's time to brush my teeth. I like to do it outside, I don't know. In a bathroom is kind of weird, I like a public restroom is kind of weird. This is the public earth, though. Let's begin. I'm still amazed how easy it is to live out of your car. I'm still amazed. Wow. Mm. <laughs> Link down below. Go subscribe if you haven't done so already. And don't forget to follow me on Twitter and Instagram. Links down below for those as well. Links for everything down below. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I'm Gloria Borger. And you can suck my ass.